Hey, what's up, guys? Let's play the video. Oh, I need my microphone. <laughs> Guys, this might be the best music video I've ever seen in my entire life. Well, I actually haven't watched it yet, but that's what people tell me. The clear frame. This is so ominous. Oh, and by the way, my name's Jordan. I'm a professional film editor for artists like these guys. Let's see what this MV is all about. Dude, that elevator is creepy as... It's a pile of people. Dude, this is crazy. All of these shots are played in reverse, so you would just have a bunch of pile of people just laying there. You know, they're all vaping at the same time, just getting so lit that they're just like... Now the funny part about this is they're all blowing to create this thing, but it looks like they're sucking the smoke into their mouth. <laughs> it looks so cool in reverse. Reverse smoke looks dope. The soundscape. Jackson, no! Ah! <laughs> That was maybe one of the most terrifying things I've ever seen in a music video. We just go from silence and stillness to a pile of people all seizing and screaming? And then they just stop? And they're like worms? This is so it tastes like cigarettes. I hit it every chance I get. Girl, you got me trippy sweat. Okay. Dude, I, 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 This is one of the best music videos I've seen this entire year. And this is actually directed by Daniel Cloud Campos. And he's been doing music videos for a long time. This dude is a master. He did Panic at the Disco, Zed Stay the Night, Madonna. And he also did Jackson Wang, A Hundred Ways. This guy has credits. Yeah, you taste like cigarettes. Ooh! Your body His eyebrow! Oh my god. That you play me like an instrument. There's so many opportunities yeah, to cut because there's people walking yeah, in front of the screen. Yeah. Oh my! Okay, the way that Daniel works with choreography and blocking, but in small spaces with one artist is just so freaking good. First of all, the amount of rehearsal yeah, that had to go into this to create like this amount of people doing such good choreography. We have lots of long, longer takes. But look at where we cut. Right there. There's a blur going on right here. Maybe a person crossing the screen. And then we cut to another shot right here where there's a person walking across the screen. So it creates honestly a match cut, but there really isn't any masking involved. It's really cool. This is my friend Tabitha. She, uh, como se dice, may or may not be a fan of Jackson. Tabitha's goal is to meet Jackson at some point. So, Jackson, if you're watching this, this is Tabitha. Hello! <laughs> Hello! You know what it is! Hello! Hello! Hey, I'm hey. <laughs> If I could tell Tabitha what to do right now to be able to meet Jackson, I would say you should become a professional editor. I'm sure that Jackson needs so many editors for his social media. So Tabitha, all you would have to do is become his social media editor. And then boom, all of a sudden you're friends with Jackson. And if you guys want to learn to become a professional editor, I just came out with my exclusive program, The Editing Formula. It's the step-by-step -step formula to get you out of your nine to five job and into a profession of a professional editor, making over $100,000 a year doing so. In this program, you will edit a Nike commercial. You'll edit a full music video shot by Jacob Owens while using the top 10 K-pop transitions that I'll show you in the course. And I'll also give you a full business plan on how to create $100,000 of income by becoming a freelance editor. So if you want to work with people like Jackson Wang or your other favorite K-pop artists, hit the link in the description. The course is open for this week only. Join the editing formula today. Your body feels like disrespect. Him wearing a corset? Okay, so here's the transition right here. Oh, that's so dope. Yeah, I'm so subtle. To it. Yeah, yeah. I felt it coming and I couldn't escape. I made a belly of the beast again. My dirty secret that keeps me awake. The camera is as much a part of the choreography as the actual dancers. 
and body movers are. Normally in this situation, we would use lots of zoom lenses, but you can feel that there's dolly movements. The camera's physically moving forward and backwards in space. Right here, back, in. The camera operator is going off. As well as the choreographer. Camera operators. This video is so fire! Oh my gosh! I thought this was a light that was on set, but I think it's part of the set. But because the set is so dark, I'm sure the director probably wanted to go back and get rid of this light and maybe take it out in VFX or something because it doesn't look like a practical light. The way that we zoomed in during the... Oh! See, that's the light I'm talking about. Oh my, the amount of dust is <laughs> crazy. What? Daniel, you need to stop going so hard in the paint. You got to leave some for the rest of us. Holy frick. I got a problem, Just look at how well it. these camera movements are so planned. So well planned. I take a hit and let it burn my lips. Everything's been storyboarded. This reminds me of some Joseph Kahn freaking directing, where everything is so freaking intentional and it looks so good. This is how you make the best music videos in the world. Those directors that have been around the block for a long time that have like just been doing music videos and other filmmaking for like 10 years, <sighs> man, they they don't come to play. Like, every cut is so perfect. Now we're using I made a belly of the beast again. <laughs> Look at this choreography. They're like a freaking grinder with the people going like this. <laughs> what the heck? Now we're probably gonna have some hidden cuts during again. these. Like right there, that looks like a cut. Well, maybe not. I can't tell. Look at this, you can just pause this. It's a freaking painting. They got such good shots. The, the whole, okay, MVPs go to the background dancers and the amount of work that they put in to make just incredible images with their bodies. And the corset. The corset's honestly the real MVP, let's be honest. Who's the queen? I'm the corset. Those zooms, the slow motion. This is so masterful. How can you make a man look this good? No, it's just one of the fans asked me, yeah. what did you eat to become so hot? Ah. So I was like, rice. Look at that transition, that was so nice. They're doing so many hidden cuts where they don't really feel like cuts, but you know, they're, they're cutting just to give themselves an ability. Okay, sorry, I just completely lost my train of thought because I was so mesmerized by the music video. So yeah, they're using lots of hidden cuts to smoothly transition us from scene to scene, or they're cutting on really fast motion. So whenever they like stand up or move or do something really fast, that's a perfect time to cut because our eye is being distracted by the fast motion. He stands up and then changes position really fast. So we cut right there and have a smooth fade to help blend that shots. This song is also a bop. Do anything. Tell me what to do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey. Drink or drink or the ridiculous. I've never seen Jackson look so sexy. Okay, Tabitha, I think you may be on to something. Sweating. Did you just blow everybody up with that with that handgun motion? 
Jackson, no! Jesus loves you, I love you. If you want to work with your favorite creators like Jackson, please check out my course. The link is in the description. Peace! Cute. Go!